And KCRA 3's Melanie Wingo is live now for us at Hawthorne Lane and 8th Street, where this home is located. Melanie, what has it been like out there? You've been there for a number of hours today. Well, investigators just wrapped up their work here at this home less than an hour ago, but all day long, this entire neighborhood has been blocked off as investigators pulled all kinds of evidence from the home of the accused killer. A quiet Davis neighborhood. It feels really surreal. Now the site of an intense hours long search at the home of Carlos Dominguez. One of our housemates saw like men in like those like white suits. And then she was like, it's our neighbor. Relief now for neighbors after a week living with a heightened sense of fear and even changing daily routines. I just bought pepper spray just for like this occasion. I like carrying it to my car, just like just from mm -hmm. the door to like, you know, the street. Police arresting Dominguez on murder and attempted murder charges in connection to three Davis stabbings. I think I was just in shock. I was like, what? Our neighbor? Like, that's crazy. Investigators now combing the house where Dominguez lived until last week he attended UC Davis, this neighborhood home to many students and longtime Davis residents. We've never seen him at all. Like, our paths have not crossed. That I didn't see him come outside very much. He definitely seemed to be a more reclusive type. Um, maybe I just also operate at different hours than him. Shock and disbelief for people who live on this block that authorities traced the suspect back to this home. It's like especially scary, like especially like leaving campus at night because like some of us have night classes as well. And like just knowing that like the killer was right next door. And back out here live during a news conference today, Davis police said that Dominguez had been home over the past week in between those deadly attacks. And we should also point out that this is just the tip of the iceberg in terms of the investigation. Although the work is done here at this home, there's still more many witnesses to be interviewed and pieces of the puzzle, so to speak, to put together as to why Dominguez allegedly carried out those stabbing attacks.